Hey there everyone, welcome to a brand new Let's Chill. So, I know it's very distracting with the rock music blaring, but we're gonna chill today. This is PC Building Simulator. So yes, I do have a save file in there that auto-saved, just because I wanted to test it out, but we're gonna start a brand new one. So, let's go ahead and start. So we're gonna start in our you know, standard little bench area. But I figured, you know, I might even call it a let's chill. I might just call it like let's talk shop or something. Because I'm going to be talking about a lot of nerdy stuff that I learned about this week. Or just nerdy stuff in general. It's still going to be a rather chill let's play. You know, just enjoying some time. Building computers. Since I can't build one in person yet. <sighs> but we're here. So, let's see what we got going on. Right, you know what? That, that music. Hold on. How, how do I change that? I don't, I don't like it. I don't like it. Thank you. I'm just going to leave that music off because that, that music is actually very annoying. What do I have? G. Albin. All the mail. Okay, so let's start with our computer. Open up the email. We have an email from Timbo2000 at supermail.com. Welcome to your new PC shop. <clears throat> hey, thanks for taking over the PC shop for me. Sorry I sound in a better state few things. The company isn't doing very well, and there's no money in the bank account. The rent and energy bills come out monthly, so make sure you have enough money for them. I had a job on the go, which would sure help with the rent. See the email below. Remember to always use thermal paste when putting on a CPU. I almost always forget and the PCs overheat. So, I think you're all set up. It's your company now, so run it how you see fit. I hope you did better than I did. Lots of love, Uncle Tim. P.S. I had to borrow $15 for fuel. You know how it is. I, I don't. Hi, Tim. I hope you can help me. My computer has been running slower than usual. I think I might have clicked on something I shouldn't have. Do I have a virus? Thanks, Gary. So, only job here is to remove the viruses. So, it's easy. Let's go ahead and pick up his computer. Gonna just drop it here. Now, gotta plug the PC in. So, let's cable this bad boy up. We're gonna just turn this boy here. We got cables to grab. If only PC building was this easy. I could just press and hold cables and plug things in where they go. But that doesn't work in real life. So, it's a shame. Alright, so now we gotta get the USB drive from the install set. And go to blah boom. We're gonna just turn it around. Press the power button. Go to the monitor. Wait for this to boot up. With easily the most annoying boot up sound ever and install the virus scanner come on put the virus scanner in good good, good god jesus what did you do to your thing gary restart Okay, so one of the things I learned about my computer build in the future is I might not even use the, uh, I was originally going to use the Fantex PHF120MPs, clean those files. I don't know what you did, but you had almost 400 viruses. Bad, Gary. No more Pornhub for you, Gary. Bad, Gary. Shut this thing down. And we're just going to do this. And take it, pick it up. Thank you. And drop it off here. <coughs> Jesus. I'm gonna collect the money. Thanks. That's a hundred dollars. And we're done. That's it for the day. Let's keep going. But yeah, like I was saying, I might not use the Fantex Halo fans or the Fantex PHMP 120F or PHF 120MP fans with the Halo Lux Digitals. Because that ends up being a grand total of $30 per fan. And while they are good for seven fans, that would run me almost $200. And it's not worth that much for all that. So I'd much rather get another set of fans that would work. And do the exact same job. So I was actually looking into RGB fans that already have the RGB in it. And I might do something like that just to get it going. 
go ahead and accept all these. I also need to get a graphics card and the more Tony Easy Store 500. Here we go shopping. Storage. Back. He wants 500 or more. Add that to the cart. That's all I can afford right now. Buy that. Thank you. All that's in transit. Back out. And we leave. So, let's see. This arrives tomorrow. These arrive tomorrow. Thank you. Go to work. Parts are here. Go pick that up. Thank you, manifest. Oh, Queen Brittany. Did I miss a computer? Did I forget to accept the job? I thought I was supposed to say three. Uh, Sherman Dental. Oh, I did. Oops. Not bad, my guy. Alright, whose computer is this? Uh, oh, this is the graphics card one. Okay, hold on. I can't do that one yet. Uh, can I just plonk you down on the floor somewhere? Fine. Take this one. So, I need to remove the side panel. I need to remove the back panel and the power supply shroud. So, like I was saying though, I will be building my own personal computer. Hopefully soon. Like, very soon. If all goes well. I might even be able to build it before November hits. Might be able to do it in like October if anything changes. And I'll just buy myself like a new PS4 or something. Get myself a PS4 Pro. Get that fancy dancy 4K rendering going on. So I could play, you know, like Monster Hunter in 4K and stuff like that. And I'm going to get instead of the Elgato Capture Card, the Aver Media one. Because of the fact that the... Let's install it. Thank you. Close this. Bada boom. Cable that thing up. Take that and plug this into the motherboard and plug this into the power supply. Bada bop boom. Uh, let's plug these back in. This there, this there, this there, and this up there and install side panels and close that up. And more. I got this back panel. Close that up. Alright, and where's your power button? I'm actually curious. Ah, it's up here. There we go. Now it's booting up. Awesome, it's done. Now I can take this bad boy back out here. Where was I about my computer? I, I just zoned out when I heard all that stuff going on. Um, yeah, you know, I changed out some of the parts. I've realized I don't have to spend as much as I thought I was going to need to spend to build it. So I'm actually really happy about that. Well, if I did that right now, I would actually like destroy the graphics card, I think. Thanks. Removing the broken one. I need to go buy... The fixed one. Collect that. Uh, that's in transit. This is here. I just need to buy the graphics card. Uh, no. Graphics card. She wants a 970 or better. I wish to buy a new one because I have a broken one. Add that to the cart. It's gonna be two ninety five. Can I do it same day delivery? Ooh, just a little out of my price bracket. Can't do that. Sorry. It'll arrive tomorrow. That's fine. All right. So while I wait for that to arrive tomorrow, end the day, go to work, pick this up. Yes. And let's uh, leave that there for now. Gonna install the new graphics card. Plug that in there. Lock that. Close this. Yeah, like I was saying, I was gonna do the Avermedia one for um 
performance for recording 4K capture cards. Let's also sell that. Thanks. Make some money that way. Now we're gonna cable these bad boys up. Bam, 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 and bam. Power. Yes, it boots. Awesome. But yeah, so Aver Media Capture Card, installing that inside my computer. Thanks. Off. And I'm going to go ahead and enjoy using the RGB SSD of the Team Group Delta Max when that comes out in September. At some point this month. So I'm going to enjoy that a lot. I uh, just need to scan you and dust you out. Okay, that's easy. So I just need to remove this. Boom, boom, ba bam, and ba bam. Good lord, man. What did you do? There's dandruff on this computer. Let's just do this. Look at how bad this is. Never let your computer get like this. You see this? This is bad. This is very, very bad. I, I genuinely cannot tell what this person must have done to their computer to do all this damage. Alright, it's all cleaned out. That's looking like an actual computer now. Good. Alright, let's install this back up. Also, let's put in the USB drive in case I need that. Yep, yeah, remove viruses. Parts, side panel, put that back on, and seal this thing up. But yeah, so, you know, I, I've I've saved like four or $500 on the actual build itself, and I'm really proud of myself for that. Oh, wait, I was about to boot it up without putting on the cables. Good job, me. Literally step, you know, 17 in the computer building process. Plug everything back in. But I'm actually really excited to do my first water cooling build. And... It's, it's just going to be fun. It's going to be really fun, and I'm going to enjoy every single minute that I can of it. Because the moment I have it going, I'm going to have a Ryzen 9. I'm going to have, you know, really strong processor in terms of... I did not mean to install shop. I meant to install the virus scanner. No. Virus scanner is what I meant to install. Thank you. But I'm really going to enjoy that. You know, it's going to be a really powerful unit. I can actually render and edit and do a whole bunch of stuff that takes me hours now. Just rendering videos on the Ryzen 5 while doable takes forever. I'm going to be rendering videos out so fast on the Ryzen 9 that I'm not going to know what to do with myself. I'm going to love it. Clean those files. Thank you. And remove. And power off. And we're just gonna take you back and plonk you down and you're out for delivery. Collect that. And where's yours? Where's my other guy? Yeah. Money in the bank, boy. Discard all these. I don't need those emails. Stuff for my daughter's PC. I need 16 gigs of RAM. Okay. In transit and discard. Let's buy 16 gigs of RAM then. Cheapest RAM we could find. Hmm. And it's the budget's 140? Okay. I can do two of these. There we go. Bye now. Awesome. Now that I got those out the way, let's go home. Yep, 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 and day. Go to work. Nag this bad boy. Lock that down. Grab those. Open this up. Remove those. You have a two gig RAM stick, Jesus. That's impressively tiny. We're gonna take that out. 
And we're gonna give you, well, I'm gonna sell that because I'm never gonna use that, literally ever. Goodbye. Let's plop that open, let's plop that open. Boom, 16 gigs of RAM. Install the case for the side panel. Boom. Boom. Bada bam and ba bam pow. And let's grab this. Put that there. The cool thing is, once I get my computer built, besides obviously, you know, faster rendering, faster uploading, stuff like that, is the fact that I'll be able to record, you know, much higher quality content, not in terms of. You know, oh, it's 1080p, oh, it's 1440p, because I need to get a better monitor for that. That That's next on the list of upgrades. But that's not a immediate rush to go get. I do have a 1440p monitor in mind that I want to get, but hmm, that'll be uh, that'll be the next thing I want to get. Unless it's on sale when I go for the... If it's on sale when I want to get my computer parts then i'll definitely get it hot and broken pc replace the air cooler clean out the dust filter okay i'll do that mm, remove viruses sure looking for an upgrade eight gigs of ram okay and cleaning out the computer so clean, RAM, viruses, and dust filter. So we need one of these. Oh, definitely not that one. That's silver budget. He wants something that's $10 or less. Martoni Thermal. We're going to get that. And he wants 8 gigs of RAM. Let's go pick that up real quick. The A data series from here. I'm just curious, do you have a budget for your RAM? $120 for 8 gigs of RAM? That's all you want? Upgrade to 8 gigabytes of RAM. You know what? You say you have white cables. I'll, I'll do you a little extra. I'll give you one of those. Alright, in transit, in transit, in transit. The Radeon 560. Wow. Okay, so these are all here. So those are all in transit. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and buy all these. Order will arrive tomorrow. So once I get the new build, though, I'm I'm definitely gonna do videos on me building the computer itself, only because of the fact that it's that much of a project. I'm going to enjoy every single minute of it because sweet Jesus, will it be fun? And I'm gonna I'm gonna do a whole video on it. Or maybe even two videos or three where I'm like planning the build. I'm going to show off the parts list and all that other stuff. Will I show my face? Who knows? That depends on if I'm in the mood for that. But other than that, I will definitely have it, you know, set up and ready to go. So let's start with the easy one. Removing viruses. Hmm. But so this one, I just need to... Plop that bad boy in. Cable it up. Now plug that in there. Plug this in here. And plug that in there. Now we're gonna power this thing on. Go over here. Add the virus scanner. Oh lordy, come on, you shouldn't take this long. There we go. What's going to be really fun with the new computer is the fact that I'm going to have a lot faster storage and a lot more storage as well. Right now I'm only running on a terabyte and a half and I'm only really using the one terabyte for video recording and stuff like that. I'm going to end up with four terabytes for all my other storage, which is like, let's say I'm recording videos and all that stuff. All that's going on the four terabytes. I'm going to have another half terabyte for my operating system and a full another terabyte for anything else. I might use my one terabyte SSD for, 
you know, saving like my game library and stuff like that so that the games boot redonkulously fast. Because right now I just have them on my 7200 RPM hard drive. Or I might even use the hard drive as a game library. Who knows? I don't know what I'm going to do yet. I just want to figure that stuff out. And as I figure it out, you know, I'll be enjoying, like, the little things I learn. Let's see. So this is just... God, what do people do with their computers? This is nasty. Nasty. What did you do? Like, drop it in a vat of just dust? Like, look at how dusty this is. This is just... This is just dandruff all over the computer. My God. Oh, this poor, poor computer. You have been mistreated. No way. I'm here to fix it. I'm here to fix. This is my job now. Nah, forget Let's Plays. I I'm the computer fixer. See all that dust there? Get off. Off of it. Off. Be free. Alright, that should be all of it. Yeah. Alright, so now to replace the air cooler. No, I did not want to open the CPU shield. Just remove the Mortoni air. Why can I not remove the Mortoni air? Oh, it's because it's still plugged in. There. Now I can remove it. And now I can install a new one. I could literally sell you for free. That is amazingly bad. And now it's too... There we go. What happens if I do... Wait, 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 wait. Nope, nope, nope. That's a bad idea. That's a big bad. Wait, because I just removed that. I need to put more thermal paste. Now I can install the CPU cooler. There we go. You always, 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 always want to remember your thermal paste. Because if you don't, you're going to have a bad time. And a very, very, very bad time. Grab this cable. Plug that up there. And this cable. And plop that in there. And this cable. Plop it up there. And this one over here. And this one up here. Now we're going to install the PC parts and reinstall that. But yeah, I'm I'm just really excited to get my build done. Like this is how I'm going to be playing or living vicariously about my PC building habit. Because I really just want to build something right, right now. And I just want to get my hands on the new build. Like, I'm so excited for it already. Go ahead and power that off. Okay, remove... That's build number two done. What about build number three? PC can boot to the operating system and just get the eight gigabytes of RAM in there. Easy enough. What kind of RAM do you have in there? Ah. You have the Team T Force Dark Red. Nice. I do actually like that RAM. I like my Nighthawks even better, but that was a good second option for me when I was actually building my computer. Let's give you the silver, though. There we go. All right. You're in budget, I believe. you got your RAM that matches your cables. Only be installed within the 4 gig RAM stick. Hmm. I don't know about that. Because I know my old computer, like my Alienware computer that I bought secondhand, had mismatched RAM sizes. I had two, because I had, I think, a total of 12 gigabytes of RAM, which is odd. I had two two sets, or two two gigabyte RAM sticks, and then two four gigabyte RAM kits, which was weird when I thought about it afterwards. I'm like, that's a thing, I guess. I'm still not sure how that works, but it was a thing, I guess. So, I don't know how that happened, but that's just what I bought. And I was still happy with my computer. My computer still worked like a dream. I couldn't do any kind of heavy editing or stuff like that, but... Well, I could. It would just take forever. 
but I'm actually so happy about that Alienware computer. I honestly do miss it. I, that was my Bertha. That was the first computer that I bought that was a quote unquote gaming computer. It was the old Alienware Aurora. And then it was the R Aurora R3. And, you know, let's clean this one out. Oh, you're just full of it. Full of dust. This is disgusting. What did, what did these people do? They're just filling you up with dandruff. It's disgusting. People need to learn how to wash their hair. That's not what I wanted to grab. This. Yes. All the dandruff must be removed. Come on. Start going somewhere. There we go. This takes forever for anything to happen here. But yeah, so... You know, I know I've been talking a lot about what I'm going to do with my computer. And I'll just show off the parts list on screen just to sort of show what I'm talking about. I need... What do you... Why is nothing plugged in? What are all these cables down here for? What are you doing? You have literally nothing plugged in right now. I'm very confused as to where that stuff is going. Uh, did I forget the keyboard? Yep, I forgot the keyboard. Yeah, off and on. There we go. Thanks. Alright, let's plug this back in. Plop, close, and we're good. But one thing I definitely want to get going is just the build itself. I just need it done. I want it done. I want to see the build in person. And I just want to have fun. Because what's going to be a nightmare is getting my windows transferred over from there to my new computer and you know it's just something as simple as like oh you know just have the product license and do all this and all that and i'm like eh, i don't know it's like it's gonna take forever to get all that stuff done collect this collect that uh, let's collect this one yeah collect that one too why not you're missing thermal paste, you say? Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, Tim, thanks, buddy. You forgot the thermal paste yet again. That sucks. Now this guy's making me do a job for free. Whatever. Easy fix. Thermal paste is like two minutes. And go to work. Let's just get this guy's computer out of his way. That's just... Lock that down there. Unplug. I didn't mean to unplug that one. Thermal paste. Reinstall the CPU cooler. No. Close the CPU shield. I wish to install. There we go. Now let's cable these things up. Air cooler. Motherboard. Okay, we're gonna the motherboard. The power supply. Uh come on. There we go. And I connect the nope, keyboard. Aha, uh -huh, I got you this time. Alright, now let's install my USB drive real quick and power this thing on. But let's see, I think this will be the last thing I do. Why do you have just doctors? It's so weird. Here, you get 3D mark. Since you're being such a little baby about your 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 your, your thermal paste. Could have done that yourself. You didn't need me to apply thermal paste for you. I mean, Tim is just an idiot, but we all know this by now. So one thing I'm definitely going to do when I get the build done, I already know I already mentioned I was going to do a whole video on it, but I'm also going to, when I actually do the video, I'm going to make sure that 
There we go. Yeah, your, your thing just sucks FPS-wise. Jesus Christ, my guy. When I actually make the video, it's going to be the entire process, like, from step to step. Like, it'll be, like, all the hardware that I have in front of me will be laid out, and I'll show off everything that's involved in the PC build. And it's just going to be probably done from my garage, so the microphone quality won't be as great. But I'll do the best I can. That or... Ooh, actually, you know what? No, I know where I'm going to record. I'm not going to record in my garage. I'll record from my room. The same way I normally record. It'll just be slightly different. But I digress, you know. It's going to be a lot of stuff to record, and it's going to be a lot of stuff to actually put together because the case is going to be monstrously heavy and I got to figure out how I'm going to get the the actual recording going because I get it's going to be very nice and even so I'll certainly do my best but enough of the whole ranting about the computer and all this other stuff this is what happens when I start talking about computers I get so sidetracked about everything going on but it's going to be a fun build it's just going to be fun I might even buy extra RAM just to go up to 32 gigabytes of RAM. Why not? Because I'm already at 16, but I could do more. And that could be fun. You know, more RAM means smoother time of actually, you know, doing rendering and doing other projects on the computer. Close that up. Power it off. And we're just going to remove you from my site. Plonk it down. There you go, it's fixed. Never message me again. Oh, I need a motherboard replacement, you say. Here, take it. Leave me be. I don't care what he did. I fixed it. Goodbye. I think we are going to leave this episode off here. I know it was a little short, but I had my fun. Other than that, guys, I will talk to you all here next time on Let's Talk Shop, I guess. I don't know what I'm going to call it. I'll think of something. Let's build. Yeah, let's do that. Let's call Let's Build PC Building Simulator. So I'll see you all here next time on Let's Build PC Building Simulator. And I will catch you all here next time, everybody. I hope you all have a great and wonderful day. Mm, let me do that again. So I'll catch you all here next time on Let's Build with AfroLad on PC Building Simulator. If you like today's episode, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below, and I will catch you all here next time. Let me know what you guys want to see me build. You know, any fancy water cooling builds or anything like that. So I will talk to you all here next time. I hope you all have a great and wonderful day.